in the last video I have shown how to use the case statement but actually in industry the logic is far complex than what was shown in the last video now we'll just take a little example you are required to heat up a water 25 to 30 degree for the 5 minute and then step number 2 30 to 35 degree for 5 minutes and 35 to 40 degree uh, okay so here we have to clear some variables I'm using a heater as a pool and step number integer now this step, step number will come from your front end that might be SCADA HMI and there all that you are showing to the end user time and the current temperature here we use the case statement say case step number Step number one and step number two, step number three. Step number one was uh, here. I have to use the if statement and the if. If T U one hundred scale hundred scale is greater than twenty five and less than now when you say the end you have to give this variable and it's less than thirty. then here if the scale value if the temperature is greater than 25 and less than 30 then what you do you simply have to switch on the heater else it should be off you and F okay in the first step temperature is greater than 25 and less than 30 then true or false now what is this and and is actually similar to this and gate uh, this and uh, ladder if it's one if this is also true then you have uh, output is true and the other hand if you have a uh, gets this must be true this true this is the end get then output will be also true okay we have done this first step copy this code and uh, here we simply have to change the checkpoint 32 35 and this is the last step is uh, 35 to 40 there is an error because uh, I have to end the case if I run now by default this is step 0 so nothing will happen even if the temperature is even the temperature is 
35 or 36 so this time temperature is 35 so this time this code of block should be run but it's not running waiting for the step now just user simply have to pass the, the, the step number one so in the step number one you will see here is greater than 25 and less than 30 now it's less than 30 therefore the heater is on because heating, heating up the water now as it reaches greater than 30 so that is off now while this is greater than 30 it means this can also be true but this code cannot run because it's not in the step number two so this is the beauty of this case statement you can have only a one place at a time okay so now let's assume that five minute is completed now is the next step step number two In the step number two, step number two we have is greater than 30. So as it's greater than 30, heater is on and less than 35. If it goes more than 35, heater is off again. Okay, then do the same thing with the step number three. Now you are in step number three step number three logic is uh, temperature should be greater than 35 because it's not greater than 35 therefore it's not switching as greater than 35 it's switched on and it will be switched off only when 3 is to 14 And uh, I don't think I will get to the 40. But you got the concept. And step number 3 is also the same as these other two. And thank you very much for watching this video.